Hello, Dull Bedsit Blogger here, and I'm doing another chili from Mr. Frizz. This time it is the uh, Naraja Picante. Nice yellow thing here. I'm going to chuck it in with uh, some broccoli, onions, and some corn. So, uh, and I'm going to have it with noodles. So let's see how it all goes when I've made it. So there it is, chopped up. And the first thing I noticed, trying to get close to that pink shadow on it. There you go. Um, the first thing I noticed was it smells very strong. So I might not put the whole chili in. I'm a big girl's blouse. Um, so shall I taste a bit? Yes, I should taste a bit. So there you go, I've got a little bit there. Let's test it out. Very floral, quite very flavorful, very a very flavor, a flowery flavor, quite perfumed. Yeah, I don't think I'm going to put the whole chili in there. Call me a big girl's flowers if you like. I don't mind. So there you go. There you have it: noodles, corn, onions, broccoli, and a picante chilies from uh, Mr. Frizz. Uh, I didn't put the whole chilli in, um, I've just seen a picture of Mr Corvette who put an entire Carolina Reaper into his dinner tonight and uh, he has rather swollen lips. Kind of scared me off a bit, so, and I am a big girl sprout. Like I was saying a bit earlier, I really noticed the strong smell of the chilli as soon as I cut in, into it and I thought it's going to be quite hot. When I had the little bit, the heat kicked in pretty quickly and I thought a whole lot is going to be a whole lot too much for me for my dinner. And I think I've timed it right because there's the right amount of uh, chilli flavour in there. A nice bit of heat just to give it a little tongue zing but not to make me go oh blink an egg I'm bleeding not so anyway gonna have my dinner now bye bye